dude, <laughs> let's, we're going on a bulking program. We're going on a bulking program. You can't, this is not healthy. Look at this. I had like two plates of food tonight. Oh my God. Dude, stop. I'm fine, mom. We're going on a bulking program. I'm, so, I'm sending you a program. Now that you've embarrassed me in front of the entire sorry, world, sorry. Taylor Harrison. Okay, ask me some questions. So uh, <laughs> let's, for anybody that doesn't know, this is my homie. I've known Kayla Harrison for a minute, big supporter. If you know me, that's I'm a big fan of the OG. Thank you, thank you. Kayla Harrison, before we talk about the fight, I want to know what this side bet was. You got, no, no. I want to know what this side no, no. bet was. Well, I lost. That's for fucking sure. But. I'm going to assume it had something to do with a TKO or a KO. Yeah. Yeah. If I, uh, I was trying to win with a head kick. Wow. Yeah. I thought, yeah. That's a bold bet. Well, you know, I believe in myself. Very true. I mean, very <laughs> true. And that's, that's kind of my next point because like, you're always going to have critics and people are going to criticize your striking and your performance, but it's very, very hard to live up to people's expectations when their expectations of you are so high. Because I feel like your striking look really good in there. Oh, thank you. Listen, no one no one has higher expectations of themselves than I I, I have of myself. Like, I, I, my team put so much into me. The UFC has put a lot into me. I bust my ass. Um, you know, I spend time away from my kids. I, I, I put a lot into this. And so when I go out there and I don't perform the way I want to perform, I'm upset, um, but I also have to give myself grace. Like, listen, Ketlin is tough as fuck, and uh, I was really flat tonight for whatever reason. I don't know if it's the altitude. I don't know if I got carried away and ate too much once I made weight. I don't know. Whatever it is, um, it wasn't my best performance, but we got the W now. We're 2-0 in the UFC, and, you know, tomorrow's a new day. And, get, I mean, going to be fighting for a world title, right? Oh, please. Yes, from your lips to God's ears, I'm ready. Fair enough. And like you said earlier in the press conference, you kind of said, listen, names really don't matter because I'm better than them all, right? So I'm, I know you're going to pay attention to the fight tonight, but it, it doesn't matter who wins, does it? No, I really don't care. I'm, I meant that. Um, and I don't care. Like, when I have the title, whoever wants to fight me for the title can fight me. Like, Amanda, fuck the girls in the PFL, the girls who are like down the street, the girls in the bar who are like, I don't care. Like, come one, come all. Like, I, I believe I'm the best in the world and I'll, I'll prove that. Why do you think you're able to generate so many eyes towards you? I know you've been doing it your whole life, right? With, with the gold medals and everything, but even at the press conference, like you get on the microphone, before you even say anything, people are cheering for you, right? So why, why do you think people are so drawn to you at this point? Uh, my sparkling personality. <laughs> your, your dashing good looks. <laughs> you know, it's all, it's how humble I am. Just like very demure. Um, no. What, is, what does that mean, by the way? I don't fucking know. Neither do I. <laughs> I have no idea. Anyways. You are, but if anyone is demure, it's this guy. Look at, between us, very classy. Jeez, back to the question. I don't know. I mean, thank you for saying that. I just, I guess because I'm real. Like, I don't, it's not an act. I'm not being fake. Like, you know, I, I think I'm a good person with a good heart, but I also talk a little shit. And so, like, I just keep it real. Last question. What's what's the celebratory, you know, what's the dinner going to look like? Bro. What's the, you're going to hang out with the kids, right? Bro. Yeah, I just saw them. They were like, so are we going to go get ice cream today or tomorrow? And I was like, both. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, we're about to go eat. We about to go eat. When can we see you back? ASAP. ASAP. Yeah. Quick turnaround. Yeah, quick turnaround. I gotta get that taste out of my mouth. If anybody gets injured, interim title, right? Fuck yeah. yes. Let's go. Absolutely. Listen, that's the homie Kayla Harrison. She's that's already the homie OG. already embarrassed me in front of everybody tonight, and uh, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sending him a bulking program. He's gonna come down to Florida. I'm gonna teach him how a real man eats. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be seeing more of you. Congratulations, Chad. Love you, homie. Love you.